How are you? And they all are the church members. And these all guys are uh, the guards of the church. Nice. Yeah. Jesus name. Sickness come out of her body. Jesus, release your healing power. Be blessed in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen.
छूट गए सुख रहते मुख कहता फर के बाढ़ सुटे न बुने भी छोड़े आगे बर के बाढ़ सुटे न बुने भी छोड़े आगे बर के दुनिया तो तेरी पल्ले पल बन गई है वाद मां तुम्हारा तेरी गल बन गई है वाद मां तुम्हारा तेरी गल बन गई है वाद मां तुम्हारा तेरी गल बन गई this blessing very real in your life today aaj main yakeen rakhta hu ki haqeeqi taur par aapki zindagi par khuda mand ki barkat aayegi but god the father from heaven blesses you aasmani khuda aasmani baap aapko barkat dega so the lord bless you khuda aapko barkat dega god keep you safe khuda aapko mahfooz rakhega god protect you and watch over you खुदा उन आपको बचाएगा और आप पर अपनी निगाह रखेगा गॉड बी विद यू और खुदा उन आपके साथ होगा द लॉर्ड मेक हिज फेस शाइन अपॉन यू खुदा उन अपना चेहरा आप पर जलवा गर करेगा द ग्लोरी ऑफ गॉड द लाइट ऑफ गॉड फ्रॉम हेवन शाइनिंग अपॉन यू और खुदा उन का जलाल खुदा उन की रोशनी आपकी जिंदगियों में चमके The Lord be gracious to you and merciful to you खुदा उन आपके लिए मेहरबान है The Lord turn his face towards you. Ah khuda un apna chehra aapki taraf matwajjo kare. The Lord see you. Khuda un aapko dekhta hai. And the Lord give you his peace. Aur khuda un aapko apna itmaan aur tasalli rakhe. So this is the blessing of God I put upon you in Jesus name. Khuda ki barkat ko main Yeshu Masi ke naam se aap par unle deta hu. And I just want to talk I now want to talk about the wisdom of God's plan. So that you can really understand well God's plan for your life. Or I'm thinking that I have to be able to do what God wants to do. So that you can fulfill God's plan for your life. So that on the day of judgment, when we have to stand before Jesus Christ, जब आखिर दिन अदालत वाले दिन हम कुरान ये सुनते के सामने खड़े होंगे, Jesus will say. to you well done good and faithful servant aur khudaon ye sunti phir adalat aakhri din adalat wale din kahe ka aap ek bahut acche aur imandar shakhs hain this is what all of us need to learn isliye hame sab ko seekhne ki zarurat hai to be the good and faithful servant of god to hame seekhne ki zarurat hai ki hum khudaon ye sunti ke imandar naukar bane because god has all power क्योंकि खुदा के पास सारी कुत और कुदरत गॉड इज ओम माई टी हाँ खुदा वन हमेशा कवि और कादर है गॉड इज अ ग्लोरियस वंडरफुल ऑसम बींग खुदा वन अजीब मुहिब और जलाल वाला खुदा है गॉड इज फिल्ड विद लाइट एंड ग्लोरी हाँ खुदा ने अपने जलाल से इस दुनिया को रोशनी से भर दिया एंड गॉड इज लव और अपनी मोहब्बत से भरा गॉड इज लव इज इटर्नल विदाउट बिगिनिंग विदाउट एंड 
खुदामन शुरू से है अब से है और This universe had a beginning because it was created by God. God alone had no beginning. He has been forever and forever and forever. He is the eternal everlasting God. And God is love. और खुदा की मोहब्बत भी इसी तरह हमेशा रहने वाली है एंड फॉर लव दे हैज टू बी समवन टू लव हां खुदा से मोहब्बत करता है जब आप दूसरों से मोहब्बत करते हैं दे हैज टू बी फेलोशिप एंड फ्रेंडशिप जब आप एक दूसरे से मोहब्बत रखते हैं तो वो भी आपसे फिर मोहब्बत रखते हैं आपसे रुफा करते हैं एंड गॉड इज इटर्नल लव बिकॉज़ देयर इज इटर्नल फ्रेंडशिप बिटवीन द फादर द सन एंड द होली स्पिरिट और खुदावन की अपनी मोहब्बत बाप बेटे और रूह कुद्दस वाली मोहब्बत We are not saying that God had a wife and had a son in that sense. No. But God illustrates His love by a father who has perfect love for His son. वो इसी तरह है कि खुदा बाप यीशु मसीह से एक मुकम्मल मोहब्बत रखता है एंड अ सन हु हैज परफेक्ट लव फॉर हिज फादर और खुदा यीशु मसीह भी खुदा बाप से कामल मोहब्बत रखता है एंड दिस इलस्ट्रेट्स द लव ऑफ गॉड बाय यीशु मसीह और खुदा के मोहब्बत से सो देयर वाज दिस इटर्नल लव एंड फ्रेंडशिप between father son and holy spirit jab hum in teenon tasleeq ke aasmoon mein mohabbat dekhte hain and that was beautiful that was amazing ye mehrat angeez aur khoobsurat hai but god in his love had a greater plan khuda ki mohabbat ke bahut sare manzoobe hain and that is to find or create the people of god dir isi mohabbat mein khuda ne duniya ke insano ko khalq kiya Now first of all God created a place called heaven. Sabse pehle khuda ban ne woh jagah ko jahan mein khudo se jate hain filled with light and his glory. Usne use apni roshni aur apni jalal se mamood kiya and God created the beautiful angels. Aur khuda ne khoobsurat farishtagan ko banaya. And there's all kinds of amazing creatures in heaven that we have little understanding about. Hum unke bare mein jo kuch khuda ne khudod mein banaya un sari cheezon ke bare mein hum thoda bahut samajh sakte hain. But God being love cannot force anyone to love him. Khuda ki mohabbat aapko majboor nahi karti ki aap bhi khuda se mohabbat kare. God gives people the choice and first of all God gave the angels the choice. खुदा ने इंसानों को भी मौका दिया कि वो जो मजीद चूज करें और इसी तरह उसने फरिश्तों को भी ये मौका दिया कि वो दाएं जाएं या बाएं जाएं या जिसकी मर्जी पैर बैठ जाए इट्स लाइक छोटे थे तो फिर बारह से छोटे बेबी पैदा होते हैं एंड वेन गॉड फर्स्ट क्रिएटेड द एंजल्स इन हेवन जब खुदा ने आसमान पर फरदोस बनाई they are created innocent aur usne sabko masoom paida kiya beguna paida kiya but there is a difference between being innocent and being holy and masoomiyat aur pakeezgi mein farq hai holy comes out of choosing to embrace the love of god jo pakeezgi hai wo khuda ke yeshu se ke fazl se khuda ki taraf se aati hai Being holy comes out of choosing the righteousness of God. Khuda ki jo pakeezgi hai wo khuda ki rasbaazi se aati hai. So first of all the angels had this choice. Acha ke pehle usne ise barbaad kiya. And the angels that chose to follow God became the holy angels. Khuda ke farishton ne khuda ki pakeezgi ke But the angels that turned away from God became the evil spirits. Ah, jo khuda ke farishte the, unhone khuda ko chhod kar phir ablis ki parvai karna shuru ki. And the leader of this rebellion or turning away from God was the devil. Ah, jisne bhagavat ki usse phir khuda ki taraf se ablis kaha gaya. So even the angels had the choice of who they would follow. तो फिर तो के भी पास मौका था कि वो 
Ablis ki pair bhi kare ya Khuda unki tuti ki pair bhi kare. Whether they would follow God and become holy. Jab ham Khuda ki pair bhi karte hain, to ham pakija bante hain, rastwaad bante hain. Or whether they would turn away from God and become evil. Aja ham Khuda se murte hain, to ham gunagar ho jate hain. Two thirds of the angels, so that's a large percentage of the angels, turn to God. दो तहाई फरिश्ते जो थे वो खुदा की तरफ थे. That's why heaven is still filled with angels. और उस वक्त जो जन्नत थी जो फरदोस था वो फरिश्तों से बड़ी थी. But one third of the angels were very foolish. They became evil. आ उनमें से एक तहाई इन तहाई बेवकूफ थे जिन्होंने अबलीस की पैरवाई की. And the devil and his fallen angels were cast out of heaven. और अबलीस और उसके साथी फरिश्तों को फरदोस से निकाल दिया गया। But God actually had a greater plan than even creating the angels. खुदा के पास मंसूबा था फरिश्तों को बनाने से पहले। God wanted to make His most special creation. खुदा ने अपनी एक खास किस्म की तखलीक को खलक किया। And He was going to make this creation in His own image. और उसने उस मखलूक को अपनी शबी पर पैदा किया। he was going to make this creation with the special ability to have friendship with God. To walk in the love of God. And become the people of God. And this special creation is you. और वो खास मखलूक आप लोग हैं। It is the human race। और वो इंसानी नस्लें इंसानी हैं। And it began when God created Adam and Eve। शुरू में खुदा ने आदम और हवा को पैदा किया। The first man, the first woman। पहली औरत और पहला मर्द created in the image of God। वो खुदा की शबी पर पैदा किए गए। and they were created innocent. और वो मसूम पैदा किए गए। But as I said, there is a difference between being innocent and being holy. हमने पहले भी बताया था कि मसूमियत और गुना पकीज की में फर्क है। So God would have to give Adam and Eve the choice. आ खुदा ने आदम और हवा को भी मौका दिया कि वो इधर जाएं या उधर जाएं। and God gives all of us the choice. और इसी तरह खुदा भी हम सब को मौका देता है। Now we were not created in heaven. We were created here on this earth. हम आसमान पर तो पैदा नहीं किए गए हम ज़मीन पर पैदा हुए हैं। And we are created in a circumstance where God knew He would have to bring salvation to the human race. आ आपके हालात जैसे भी हों तो खुदावन जानता है कि आपको कैसे नजात देनी है। because God already knew that Adam and Eve would sin. Khuda hamesha janta hai ke Adam aur Hawa ne guna kiya. And he would have to remove them from the beautiful garden. Aur phir Khuda ne Adam aur Hawa ko Baagya Adam se bahir kar diya. But God already had a great plan so that he could save the human race. Aur Khuda ke paas manjubah tha ke wo nasle insani ko bachai. And so that he could reveal his love to the human race. और फिर उसने नस्ले इंसानी पर अपने अपनी मोहब्बत को जाहिर किया. So that whoever opens their heart to God's love, God's love can come into their hearts. अगर आप खुदा की मोहब्बत के लिए अपने दिलों को खोलते हैं, तो फिर आपके दिल खुदा की मोहब्बत से बढ़ जाते हैं. So I'll explain the difference between an angel and a human being. मैं कोशिश करूंगा कि आपको साथ शेयर करूं कि फरिश्तों और इंसान में क्या फर्क है। An angel is a spirit। फरिश्ते एक रूह है। But a human being is a spirit, soul and body। और जो इंसान है वो रूह, जान और बदन से मिलकर बनता है। And we have this human body of flesh and blood। और जो हमारा ये बदन है वो खून और गोश्त है। now, when the angels of heaven sinned, there was no excuse for their sin. आ जो जिन फरिश्तों ने आसमान पर गुनाह किया, उन्होंने उनके पास कोई मौका नहीं था। Because they saw God face to face, they knew the truth. 
وہ خدا کو آمنے سامنے جانتے تھے اور خدا ان کے ان کو جانتا تھا اور وہ انہوں نے کوئی معافی نہ مانگی اپنے گناہ سے And that's why there is also no salvation for the devil. There is no salvation for the evil spirit. But with us as human beings, God gave us this body of flesh and blood. And God said to Adam, Adam and Eve that if you sin, you will die. تو خدا نے آدم اور آبا کو حکم دیا کہ اگر آپ گناہ کریں گے تو آپ مر جائیں گے جب آدم اور ہوا نے گناہ کیا تو موت کی جو لانت ہے وہ دنیا پر آئی But God knew that this would happen. اور خدا جانتا تھا کہ یہ کیا ہوا ہے Because he had a plan how to rescue and break the curse of death. And give the gift of eternal life to whoever receives his love. And to fulfill this plan, اور اس منصوبے کو پورا کرنے کے لیے to overcome the curse of death اور موت کی لانت پر غالب آنے کے لیے at the right point of time اور صحیح وقت تھا the son of God would be born on this earth اور خدا میں جس نے اس دنیا میں پیدا ہوئے and become a human being اور وہ ایک انسان بنا so that he could die for the sins of the world اور وہ دنیا کے گناہوں کے لیے مر گیا but on the third day he would rise from the dead اور وہ تیسے دن مردوں میں سے جی اٹھا and he would pay the price for the salvation of humankind and this would be a demonstration of God's love for you that's why one of the most important Bible verses tells us that God loves the whole world that he gave his one and only son that whoever believes in him will not perish but have eternal life so that was God's plan to bring the Savior to this world to reveal his love for you اپنی محبت کو آپ پر ظاہر کرے and Jesus died on the cross for your sins because he loves you خدا من جسم سی نے سلیب پر اس لیے جان دی کیونکہ خدا آپ سے محبت کرتا ہے and he wants to restore you to your place in heaven اور تاکہ آپ دوبارہ فردوس میں جا سکیں and God knew that all of us here on earth would be sinners اور خدا جانتا ہے کہ دنیا میں موجود سارے شخص گناہگار ہیں our sin would stop us from going to heaven But Jesus Christ, the righteous one, the holy one, would take his, our sin upon his body. And he would pay the price for our forgiveness. Actually, we can't go to heaven just by trying to be good. ہم اپنے تائیں اپنے آپ کو اچھے کاموں کو بدلتے ہم خدوس میں نہیں جاتے We can only go to heaven through receiving the righteousness of Jesus Christ ہم رکھی مسیح کی پکیزی کے راتبازی کے راتبازی کے راتبازی کے راتبازی خدوس میں نہیں جاتے That's why we have to give our sins to Jesus اس لیے ہم اپنے گناہ یہ سنسی کو دیتے ہیں And Jesus gives us his righteousness اور خدا پھر آپ کو اپنے راتبازی دیتا ہے He writes our name in the book in heaven اور پھر وہ خدا بے جات میں آپ کے نام لکھتا ہے So when the time comes when we die and our spirit leaves our body, He will send His angels to escort us to heaven. And we will be able to dwell in the holiness of God. 
And it's because Jesus Christ is the Savior of the world. When we open our hearts to Him, He comes into our hearts. This is how we can know for certain that we have our place in heaven. And that God is our Heavenly Father. We have to believe in our hearts that Jesus died on the cross for our sins. That's all the bad things, all the wrong things that have happened in this world. God had to give the sacrifice for our sins. And God did give that sacrifice for you. Jesus went to the cross for you. The Bible warns us that those who are dying and perishing in their sins, the cross is foolishness to them. But to us who believe, the cross is the power of God. Jesus dying on the cross for you is the power of salvation. But of course to save us, Jesus had to conquer the devil, conquer death. Believing and acknowledging that Jesus Christ is alive. See, the devil is defeated by the resurrection of Jesus Christ. And Jesus revealed himself to his chosen apostles so that they would go out into all the world preaching about Jesus Christ. So that whoever believes can receive God's love into their hearts. And their message was that Jesus is alive. We are not following a dead saviour, we are following the living saviour. And after Jesus revealed himself to his apostles, he then ascended up to heaven. Jesus went up, up, up into the sky. And then the disciples could no longer see him. But Jesus is promising to prepare a place in heaven for whoever believes in him. And this is the gift of eternal life that Jesus offers to all people. So we have to believe in our hearts, have faith in your heart that Jesus is alive. But then you have to confess with your mouth that Jesus is Lord. This is a step of putting your faith in Jesus and making it personal to your own life saying Jesus is my saviour. This is our confession of salvation. Jesus is Lord. So let's all say these words together right now. Let's say these words together right now. So I want you to repeat after my translator. Uh, 
आप लोग फिर उसे रिपीट करेंगे यानी कि मेरे पीछे पीछे बोलेंगे पहले ब्रदर बोलेंगे फिर मैं बोलूँगा फिर आप बोलेंगे Jesus is Lord. Khudaman Musi Khuda hai. Khudaman Musi Khuda hai. Jesus is my Lord. Khudaman mera Khuda hai. Khudaman mera Khuda hai. Jesus is my King. Yesu Musi Badsha hai. Yesu Musi Badsha hai. Jesus is my friend. Yesu Musi mera dost hai. Yesu Musi mera dost hai. Jesus is my way to heaven. खुदामन यीशु खदोस में मेरा इंतजार कर रहा है आई एम अ चाइल्ड ऑफ गॉड मैं खुदा का बेटा या बेटी हूँ गॉड इज माई हेवनली फादर खुदा आसमानी बाप मेरा बाप है I also want to say a prayer for you now. Um, let's pray. Thank you for these beautiful people of God. Um, in khubsurat logon ke liye khuda ka shukar ada karte hain. I pray that they are very encouraged today. Maine hum dua karte hain ki inki haosla pagai ho. To follow Jesus all the days of their lives. Taaki ye saari zindagi khudaan ke piche chalte rahe. Knowing that we are a family, ताकि ये जान सके कि हम एक खानदान की सूरत में हैं. The greatest family in the world. ये सबसे बड़ी बड़ा खानदान है पूरी दुनिया में. The family of brothers and sisters who belong to Jesus. ये सारे मुसीम में बैंड बनी हैं जो खुदाम ये मुसीम पर ईमान रखते हैं. Make every Christian the true Christian and strong Christian. ऐ खुदावन हर मुसीम को ईमानदार और जातीय अस्ताम मुसीम बना. Bless these people of God. ऐ खुदावन अपने लोगों को बरकत दे. Lord, we have spoken many blessings today. I could have done more, sir, but God could have demanded it. That the face of God shine upon every person. I could have done more, sir, but God could have demanded it. Lord, let them receive more of God's love in their hearts. I could have done more, sir, but God could have demanded it. Lord, let them receive more of God's love in their hearts. Receive God's peace. और इनके दिलों को इतमान और तसली से भर दे रिसीव द जॉय ऑफ सेल्वेशन ताकि ये निजात की खुशी को पा सके रिसीव द होली स्पिरिट ऑफ गॉड ताकि ये रूह की दशा मसाकल कर सके रिसीव ऑल ऑफ दिस ब्लेसिंग ताकि ये सारी बरकत हासिल कर सके इन जीसस वंडरफुल नेम के महीन नाम में आमीन